Hey YouTube, today I'm going to show you guys some creativity art games to just kind of get those juices flowing. Hey YouTube, so I wanted to do a video about different art games. There's a group that is a meetup that some friends started and it's called Art Hacks. And I met them through this meetup.com when we first moved to our new city and there was a meetup called Art Hacks and I was like, that sounds cool. So I started going to it and met some really cool people and we became friends and it's still going on uh, almost a year later. We get together and hang out. Um, right now it's this place called Paper Street Brewery. It's just a cool hangout spot. And we make art. It's a lot of the same core group of people and other new people that are kind of becoming like new core people, which is awesome and I love it. It started out as a group where we just came and brought what we were working on and all worked together on different projects. Some people would do journals or some people would do sketches. I usually just did sketchbook stuff and just hung out with people to get that creative creativity, like hang out with creative people. Jaime has been bringing these like different art games and we've been playing art games together and it's just creativity. So I'm going to show you guys a couple of these different games. The first game is you take a piece of paper and you fold it into three sections. And you take this first one and you draw a head on it. And then you'll make little lines on the next side so the next person knows where the neck ends. And the next person draws the body. And the third person draws the feet. And so you pass it around. And we did, we all did pen for these ones. So the first person would do a head. And then they would turn it over and then you would pass it to the next person and they'd do the body. And then you'd pass it to the third person and they'd do the feet. And you'd only, so like, let's say the head is here, which it, you can kind of see it through. Don't tell. I'll show you this. This one was one of the best ones, so I'm going to show it to you guys. But you'd do the head, and then you'd make little marks to go over onto the next side, so then they'd have the little marks, and then you'd continue the body. So you get all through three people. You don't look at each other's, and at the end, you open it up, and you usually have something pretty funny. Um, this was our favorite one. Oh, my goodness. This was just like um, Jaime and I were the first two people there uh, when we started the games. So this one, my friend Jaime, who you should check out his Instagram. I'll put it in the comments. But Jaime did the head. I did the body, and then Jaime did the feet. And so it, it turned out hilarious. And like we even both, like since we couldn't lift the pen, it was a challenge, but I gave it these like hairy arms kind of, um, not really intentional. I started trying to shade it, but then it turned into like the perfect hairy arm combination because both, both of us had to do that like texture thing. And so it was a really funny drawing. We all did pen for these ones and we did two minute sections and we couldn't lift our pen off the paper for the whole time. So, so the first one is the fold it in three sections and then you pass it around and each person does a section and then you pass it to the next person. That's the first game with the ink and you can't lift the pen, you do two minute sections each. The next game we played, uh, we did it two different ways. When there were only the two of us and we were waiting for the others, like some people had left and some people were waiting for other people to come. Uh, you pick a concept. There were only two of us so we did two sections. Um, each one, we did one with our left hand, one with our right hand and then we passed around. So it's four sections each. We each did two on each paper. And these were the two that we came up with. The topic we picked was goblins. Both of them turned out really awesome. I love them both. But they're kind of just goofy and funny. When there was the big group of us, this is one of the best drawings from that section that I picked out. We picked the concept, I think, forgiveness. It was like a random word in the room. There were five of us, so we did six, two or three minute blocks of time on this one. And we could lift our pen for this game. But you can see there's just lots of goofiness on it. I did mostly the swirls, like the swirls. I didn't do all of the swirls, but I did a lot of the connecting of the swirls. The games, those are the games we played at Art Hacks, and they're just little simple games. You can make up your own rules if you want to all use a different color, or if you want to use like different darknesses of pencil, or if you wanted to use like grayscale markers or something, you could do that. Each person has a different marker. You could make up rules where you can't lift the pen, or you have to do it with your eyes closed, or you could do three minutes, two minutes. Uh, just It's up to you guys. You can make up your own rules. So let me know if you play these games. Also, if you liked this video, be sure to subscribe. Let me know below. Thumbs up um, so I know what you guys like. And if you want to see more, Tuesdays I'll be posting some sort of studio tour, artwork in my studio. Thursday is something a bit more vloggish like this where I'm talking to you. And uh, usually art topics, maybe other things as well. Let me know what you want to hear about. Then I have a couple other projects that I'm doing uh, that will be other random videos. They may go up on Thursdays. I don't, just kind of whenever. So yeah, subscribe if you liked it, and I will see you guys around.